so here we are asked a simple but interesting question that given a string like say hello my name is okay so this is a sentence and now you don't have to reverse the sentence itself but you have to reverse the words of the sentence so it should now become something like the reverse string will be is name my hello okay so this should be the idea that the result should be is name my hello so the reverse the words so words of a string or sentence okay and this is not equal to reverse a string okay so now you have to tell how to do this thing what comes in your mind when you are asked reverse which data structure comes into your mind yes you are right it's stack whenever we have to reverse something stack is the best way okay you have to take help of the tool stack the data structure stack and here also reverse so somehow we have so now the thing is if you want to reverse what next question is what do you want to reverse so in reversing a string what is the thing we want reverse characters but here reverse the words of a string what do you want to reverse the words so what will you do we will push all the words of the string of the sentence into the stack now the next question okay first is push all words on to a stack very good okay but then how to how to find words so this is my second question how will i find words in a sentence so how will you do that we will use delimiters okay so this is the delimiter what is the delimiter how will you separate the words in a sentence so it is the space wherever i find a space space then i will say that okay a new word has started okay so this is delimiter and you can do a simple coding to now make tokens of this or words but here i will use java we already have a string tokenizer okay so we already have a string tokenizer so what we will do is just i will say i will have a stack so i will say that okay what should i do okay let's try to write it here itself so void reverse and i pass the string str then what will happen void reverse string and then what we will do is that we will make a stack st is equal to new stack so we will make a stack and then what we will do so then what we have to do is to now push all the tokens so first thing is how we will now find tokens so we will find tokens using so string tokenizer so string tokenizer tk 
is equal to new string tokenizer that we will do and then what I will give here the string also so it will be str here now what will I do while tk has more tokens so while the to tk has more tokens what I will do I will say that a string temp is equal to tk dot next token so I will get the words and now what I will do I will just say that st dot push temp so I will now push the tokens and this way all the words will go into the stack and then what we need to do we just need to pop things out of the stack to print it okay so what we will do while so we will do something like while I will just push for how many counts are there so let's say that the count of tokens we can find out using the count so I will say that count int count is equal to tk dot count tokens and then what we have to do what we have to do now so we will say that okay for int i is equal to 0 i is less than count i plus plus and now I will just do system dot out dot print ln and what we will do now so we will say st dot pop so this will pop the tokens for me and we can now read the whole words okay so now next thing is so this was the first example and we will see how it runs so we see that let's say it was hello and then what we say hello my name is okay so now what will happen I have a stack and then I will be tokenizing the string and first thing I will push is hello so let's see the code so what I was doing while token has more tokens so it had four tokens so first thing what I did string temp is equal to tk dot nest token I took the token and pushed it on the stack so I pushed hello then still one more token is there my so my comes into the stack then name is pushed onto the stack and then is is pushed so now what I do see let's see the code so now I find int count is equal to tk dot count tokens in fact this line you should write it here itself otherwise you will not now after I have removed all the tokens count might be zero so this line should go here okay and then what will happen so I have till the token count is there so I pop all the things from the stack so first thing that will come out is what first thing will be is then it will be name then my and then hello so this is the most easiest example but something better can be what so something better can be like I will tell you the algorithm and it's beautiful so we will first reverse complete string okay so we will reverse the complete string so what will it become now it will become s i then space e m a n then space then it will be 
y m and then o l l e h so we have got now the reverse string so this is reverse string but this is not what we want so now what i do these are now the tokens so if i now tokenize this string using string tokenizer and then i will reverse the strings so what i do now what i do is now i reverse this whichever is this is my first token so i reverse it it becomes is then a space is there reverse this second token it will become n a m e then third token m y and the fourth token will be h e l l o so this is a very simple algorithm and it's much better algorithmically because we are doing a lot of things here instead of just letting the string tokenizer class do it so we are now reversing the words as well here so how will we write the code so let's see so this is now reverse string 2 and we will write what so we will write cap reverse is equal to new cap and what will be the length length will be the same as str dot l length so it will be str dot length so we make a reverse string as we showed in the example so we reverse the string here so that is what i did here by writing now what i do for int i is equal to 0 i is less than str dot length i plus plus and i do now what i do is so i am filling the reverse string with the so it will be str dot length minus i minus 1 so i am just reversing using this statement is equal to str dot care at i so this will reverse the complete string for me so now let's see what i will do now now i ha again have the completely reversed string which is this one so now i have to tokenize it so what i will do so first i store this in a string for making my life simple so string reverse string is equal to new string and i give the reverse str so so this will be just the reverse not str so this will be my now reverse string is there to make my life simple then i write the string tokenizer so string tokenizer tk is equal to new string tokenizer so now what i am doing and i will pass the reverse string to it so now what happens my aim is to tokenize all these words and that's what i did here now what now what i will do is while to so it will be not while tk dot has more token so what should i do now while it has more tokens 
तो आई विल स्टोर देम समेर स्ट्रिंग टेम इज इक्वल टू टी के डॉट नेक्स्ट टोकन सो आई विल गेट द वर्ड एंड देन वॉट आई डू सो आई एम गेटिंग नाउ विच वर्ड्स सो आई एम गेटिंग वर्ड्स लाइक एस आई ई एम ए एन वाई एम एक्सेट्रा सो नाउ वॉट आई नीड टू डू नाउ आई नीड टू प्रिंट दैम इन द रिवर्स ऑर्डर बिकॉज वी सी दैट दे वर द इन द रिवर्स ऑर्डर सो आई हैव टू प्रिंट दैम इन द रिवर्स ऑर्डर सो आई डू वॉट फॉर int i is equal to temp dot length minus one i minus minus oh no so it's not i minus minus uh, the condition so the condition will be i is greater than equal to zero i minus minus and then what i do system dot out dot print ln print f i do percentage c and then temp dot char at i so this way i print what i print all the strings now the tokens in reverse order isn't it so i do this thing and then what so this is printed and let's also put this in bracket so here my bracket ends so i have to print one line so i will do system dot out dot print ln so this will now print a line for me which will separate all the words and then what i do so my while loop has ended here and then my whole method has also ended so this is now what was happening so i reversed the complete string here so this was the initial string i defined the reverse string then i put the value of in the reverse string i made a reverse string from the reverse array i made a string tokenizer i passed the reverse string to it and while it had more tokens so i got the tokens and printed the characters of the token in the reverse order so this is what here it is happening i took the sentence i reversed it completely then i had the tokens from them and i reversed the tokens so this is about reversing a string with the words okay and this is not reversing the words of the string and not reversing the complete string so i hope you like it so If you like this video please subscribe to my channel you can give comments you can tell me if there is some error in the code i will appreciate it and correct it thanks a lot